All right. <clears throat> so this is Kenny Santos out of Toronto, Canada for KennySantos.com. I'm glad I'm able to do a video this morning because it's raining, it's in the park. I found a little bit of an alcove. And uh, so it doesn't sound like, or, or it doesn't seem like the sound would be interfering a little bit, but I found kind of like a dry spot here. Um, today's Friday, so it's time for another book review. Today I'm doing a book review by uh, a book by Rhonda Byrne, and Rhonda's been doing a bunch of books ever since she released The Secret. Uh, I believe The Secret came up, then The Power, then the book that I'm going to talk about today. It's called The Magic. Um, this book resonated with me when I first read it, or read the title, uh, because uh, some of you may know uh, I'm an amateur magician. Love magic. Obviously, Ron is not talking about sleight of hand or anything like that, but she's talking about the magic of gratitude in this book. And this is not one of those books that you bring to the beach or, or um, you know, you kind of bring on a trip in the hopes of reading. I actually had a friend that uh, she got this for Christmas and she said, oh, I'm going to read this when I go down to Florida. And I had to point out to her, um, you know, I've read that book before. It's an awesome book, but it's not the type of book you want to go to the beach with because basically how it works is that it teaches you gratitude and it gives you uh, 20, it's a 28 day read and it gives you assignments to do every day. And so, and it, it, it's not the type of thing that you kind of get lost in. I mean, you read two, three, four pages or however long the chapter is, and then they tell you to do something by the next day, and it's not something that you could just kind of advance in the next book, kind of ruins it. And the type of book that I love, I love the type of book that gives you assignments to do um, because I feel like I get more out of it. And this one obviously teaches gratitude. And gratitude, you know, if you're a believer like I am, attracts more blessings to you. And how does it attract more blessings? You know, gratitude makes you happier, all right? You cannot be happier um, if you aren't grateful for something every single day. If you And all, basically all gratitude is is about thinking about the things that make you happy. I'm happy about the sun. I'm happy about the rain that waters my tomato plants. I'm happy about having this jacket so I don't get so wet. I'm happy about this hat that uh, my brother and my sister-in-law gave to me. And you just think about the stuff that makes you happy. You know what, maybe, you know what, you got a newborn baby at home. Nothing, some of you guys don't know this about me, but nothing makes me more happy than holding a sleeping child. There's just something about that. When they're kind of like dead weight in your arms, especially if they put their head on your shoulder. Love that, that makes me happy. Just thinking about that makes me smile. And so when you're happier, you're easier to be around, you, um, you track more opportunities, and that's where all the opportunities come, or that's where all, the blessings come from, sorry about the, there's a vehicle going by here. That's where blessings come from. They come from more opportunities. And when you're happier, people want to be around you more. They want to offer you more opportunities. And this, book, um, this is what this book really, really talks about. And one of the things, one of the passages that I took from the book, actually, I can't remember where it is in the book right now, but basically it says, um, my job is to simply list what I want not how what I'm going to get what I want. The how will be done for me when gratitude works its magic. And if you're a believer, it'll happen. If you're not a believer, then I hope you believe soon. And so, um, do I recommend this book? Absolutely. It's uh, kind of like a supplemental book. If you go and need a book that you want to take to the beach or, you know what, take on a trip and get lost in, um, this isn't that book, but it's certainly a book that you can bring along with you and do some of those daily assignments with and come back even happier than you were. So, trust you got some great value out of this. What I invite you to do is this, is to like, subscribe, share, and comment. Also, if you want to see more videos just like this, go over to my blog, it's KennySantos.com. You put your name and email in, you're going to get an awesome audio and grow in your business. Remember this, every day, multiple times a day, the universe sends us miracles. All we got to do is recognize those miracles and then accept them, all right? In the meantime, spread good guys, sorry, spread good vibes and create a great day.